Oh. <laughs> that was good. Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is actually going to be a really fun one. I've seen a couple people do this, and actually, one of my favorite YouTubers, Haley Bam, posted this video today, oh. which is what reminded me of it. And guess what book her boyfriend picked out? Uh, Say it. Red Rising. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't that yep. insane? It's because it's a good book. He picked Red Rising for her. It's probably his favorite. Anyways, too. um, t if you can't tell by today's video or the title or what we're discussing, my boyfriend here, London, is going to go ahead and pick out my June TBR. I'm thinking about six books that he'll pick out. Um, six a month is pretty good. Yeah, but I'm gonna add on top of that, probably. Okay, go off. Slay, as the kids say. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm going to leave the room while he's picking, and we're excited to see what London picks out. I already know two of the books. <laughs> you one don't of, know nothing. One of them I told him to pick, so. Oh. Yeah. I almost forgot about that one. Yeah. He's, yeah, he's gonna go ahead and do that, and I'll be in the next room. Yo, 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 what's up? London. Okay, this is as good as we can get the camera. Um, you can kind of see, should I move these tulips? Oh yeah, those are. All right, guys. Well, first, duh. Red Rising is my favorite book of all time. So, one. This is the obligatory book. House of Sky and Breath. Interesting. Um, it's huge. 1984 is fantastic. That's a classic. She should have read this one by now. George Orwell. That is a very good one. Uh, yes, yeah, so it's probably gonna be a quick read for her. Oh. Okay. I've heard. Uh, this is the Atlas Six. That's. Don't open your eyes and put the book on. See if you can guess it. Night Circus? <laughs> That's pretty good. Oh my gosh, it's Night Circus. Okay, what made you choose this book? Uh, you picked it a long time ago. I read the back and it does sound really interesting. Like it's like a little like slice of what's happening in this little circus. Yeah. So, yeah, and Great. it sounds like good writing. Yeah, I'm really excited about this one. Yeah, should Lennon be. You and picked it out a long time ago. <laughs> I have been obsessed with fantasy, and after I read the Carval series and a Broken Heart series, um, which I want him to read so bad. Carval, it's all my to be read. TBR. We'll see. Guys, convince him to make a good read. Whoa. Convince him to make a good read, please. I'm excited about this. I'm kind of glad you picked that one. Okay, next one. Okay. Am I still trying to guess what it is? Of course. Okay. It. And I feel the thrift books on it. So is it the chemist? <laughs> it's pretty good. You know your books. <laughs> it's the chemist. Why'd you pick this one? Uh, well, my mother's read it, <laughs> and she says it's pretty good. She she said I should read it. Really? Yeah, I think so it was the chemist. Maybe you should read it too. Or maybe it was the circle. I think it was the chemist. Yeah. Um, no, this one's I've really heard popular. I've heard or it used very, to be. Very good. Yeah. So Stephanie Meyer is obviously the author of Twilight. Actually, today when we're filming this is 20 years of Twilight. This is 20 years ago. Stephanie Meyer started writing Twilight. Wow. If you haven't gotten on thrift books, you need to do it now. I've said that in so many videos. Not sponsored though. I don't even know what this is about, and I kind of don't want to know. I didn't read it I the don't, back either. I don't think I want to read the back. I think I just want to kind of go into it. That's good. Okay. It's a national bestseller. Alrighty. Should I put it up here? Because okay. I think I was holding it too low for them to see. Yeah, that's perfect. Ooh. Atlas 6. 
<laughs> you doing that? I have no idea. I love the cover art. Too. Isn't that yeah? It's definitely sci fi. I like this on my more own. than the published version, how it looks. Really? Yeah. Um, okay, cool. I'm so excited. Thanks, Lemon. Yeah. You looked. I just I just looked. This was on the top shelf. Yeah. Okay, I forgot I put this on the top shelf. Have you so read I would that? have never guessed this. No, I haven't. Isn't this cover so cute? I like the cover. It's a it's a classic. Yeah. That's why I picked it. Um, it's very good. It's like a everyone should read it kind of book. Um, but it should be a quick read. I think it will be. And I got this in um, Oxford. I'm pretty sure. Really? I'm pretty sure I got this in... No, no, no. I got this in Cambridge. Oh, this book so in Cambridge. How out of this country? At Heifers. <laughs> Heifers. Yep. I already know the last two. You gotta guess. Okay. Whoa, <sighs> red... Wait, I thought Red Rising had a lip for some reason. How do you know it's Red Rising? It has to be, because there's only two more. And then a house of breath and sky. Sky and breath? Sky and breath. Sky and breath and Red Rising! Ah! What made you pick these? Red Rising uh, is my favorite book. Uh, it has been for a while. Um, super good. Everyone read it. Uh, even my pharmacist recommends it, so I'll take it from her. And then this one, uh, I was forced to pick it. Yeah, I'm actually currently reading these two, so they're going to be on You're my You're not tree. currently reading that? What? I mean, it. I've read two chapters, so that's currently and, and reading. And stopped like a week or two. Like a month. That's worse! <laughs> so for the oh, six book. books, for the six books that Lennon picked out, um, just to do a little recap, the first book we have is 1984 by George Orwell. Um, I actually got this copy while I was in Cambridge, so that's super exciting. Um, but yeah, this is such a cute like cover of a classic, and I'm super excited for this. A lot of... We have two fantasies. Love fantasy. We have Night Circus and The Atlas Six. I am very excited for both of these. This um, I picked up a couple months ago just to read because I was in a fantasy mood. And then this was super popular... I don't know like a year or two ago and i have the independently published copy which i think is super exciting three fantasies so this is a third fantasy this is what i'm currently reading um and this is the second book in the crescent city series and so far it's super good i'm already predicting it's going to be five stars our red rising and the chemist and these are both sci-fi this so is sci-fi it looks more fiction but don't worry don't read the back i feel like it Maybe it's fiction. Okay, so I lied. This isn't sci-fi. We looked it up on Storygraph. It fiction, was mystery, romance. Fiction, romance, thriller. Thriller. So that's super interesting too. Yeah. So I feel like we have a good little haul here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll update you at the end of the month. Maybe with London. Maybe we can recap. But maybe. yeah, that is the end of this video. Peace, peace. and love. Bye, guys. See ya.